Hello dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before proceeding further, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pane and watch video completely. If you find some are important, then pause the video, note it and proceed further. Although you have find any difficulties or problem, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Okay, what the question says? Here the question is, the initial velocity pi required to project a body vertically upward from the surface of the earth to reach a height of 10 r, where r is the radius of the earth, may be described in terms of escape velocity pe. E is written as subscript. And now, such that VI equal to X upon Y VI. Then, we have find out the value of X. Now, here again, firstly, we have to find out on which fact the question is based. Here, the question is based on the laws of conservation of energy. Here, any object, any body, we have considered satellite, which is ejected and reaches up to the height of B. Here, the distance is given from the surface of the earth is 10 R. And this distance means radius of the earth is capital R and mass of the earth is A. Here, total potential energy at the point of A is equal to total energy at the point of B. That is the equal. So, it is the gist of this question. So, whenever you have to solve any question, firstly, you have read the question thoroughly and then find out what is the central idea of the question and what is data we have given. Okay? So, let me have solved this question. Now, here, total energy. Total energy means potential energy. G, capital M. Capital M means mass of the earth. Small m, mass of the body, satellite, anything else. And the radius from the distance from the center of the earth means r. Here, the energy, what is energy, initial energy is given? Vi square. Equal to, now, the potential energy. Minus g m small m. And what is the distance we have to take? Here, we have to find out the distance is 10 r. This is the 10 r and this is the r. Now, total distance is 11 r from the center of the earth. So, we have put here 11 R and kinetic energy at the point of B is 0. Now, transposing this term to the right side, it become positive. So, here G capital M small m by R. Now, 1 by 2 m v i square, taking the LCM 11 r, now minus g m small m plus 11 g m small m. Now, it become 11 minus 1 means 10 g m small m by 11 r. 1 by 2 m v i square. Small m, small m cancel out. v i square equal to 10 to the 20 g m upon 11 r. Then v i square can be written, v i can be written as square of 20 g m 11 r. Now, you can see that v i 10 by 11 and root 2 g m by r. It can be written as we adjusted because escape velocity can be written as twice g m by r. So, here in the place of 2 g m r, v i can be written as v e escape velocity. Now you can see compare what we have given root x by y into v e 
you can see that this is y this is escape velocity and we have only find out the value of x so our correct answer is x equal to 10 i hope so you have understand this question clearly thank you for staying till the end of the video and yes don't forget to subscribe my channel that can get the link for the next video thank you take care and bye bye hello dear students i am ajay karmarkar before proceeding further i would like to say something please sit with copy pen and watch video completely if you find some very important then pause the video note it and proceed further although you have find any difficulties or problem then please write in comment box i will definitely solve your problem and along with please like share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students thank you okay what the question says here the question is the initial velocity pi required to project a body vertically upward from the surface of the earth to reach a height of 10 r where r is the radius of the earth may be described in terms of escape velocity pe e is written as subscript and now such that vi equal to x upon y vi then we have find out the value of x now here again firstly we have to find out on which fact the question is based here the question is based on the laws of conservation of energy here any object any body we have consider satellite which is ejected and reaches up to the height of b here the distance is given from the surface of the earth is 10 r and this distance means radius of the earth is capital r and mass of the earth is a here total potential energy at the point of a is equals to total energy at the point of b that is the equal so it is the gist of this question so whenever you have to solve any question firstly you have read the question thoroughly and then find out what is the central idea of the question and what is data we have given okay so let me have solve this question. now here total energy total energy means potential energy g capital m capital m means mass of the earth small m mass of the body satellite anything else and the radius from the same distance from the center of the earth means r here the energy what is energy initial energy is given v i square equal to now the potential energy minus g m small m and what is the distance we have to take here we have just find out the distance is 10 r this is the 10 r and this is the r now total distance is 11 r from the center of the earth so we have put here 11 r and kinetic energy at the point of b is zero now transposing this term to the right side it become positive so here g capital m small m by r now 1 by 2 m v i square taking the lcm 11 r now minus g m small m plus 11 g m small m now it become 11 minus 1 means 10 g m small m by 11 r 1 by 2 m v i square small m small m cancel out v i square equal to 10 to the 20 g m upon 11 r then v i square can be written v i can be written as square of 20 g m 11 r now you can see that v i 10 by 11 and root 
2 g m by r. It can be written as the adjusted because escape velocity can be written as twice g m by r. So here in the place of 2 g m r, v i can be written as v e escape velocity. Now you can see compare what we have given root x by y into v e. You can see that this is y, this is escape velocity and we have only find out the value of x. So our correct answer is x equal to 10. I hope so. You have understand this question clearly. Thank you for staying till the end of the video. And yes, don't forget to subscribe my channel that can get the link for the next video. Thank you. Take care and bye-bye.